Greens one all. How's everyone doing? I hope well. I wanted to share with you a uh, a quick mail call. I got something really cool from Bruce at Fab Creations. Uh, let's get it ripped open. Alrighty. So this came in on Saturday. Today is Monday. I've been uh, just itching at opening this because I've not even laid my hands on it yet. I mean, other than the package. Get the uh, LT right knife. Oh. Uh, I double wrapped it. Okay. Gotta be here careful how I open it because uh, I don't want to tear into it too eagerly like I did with the um, windshield I have. Crow enclosure. I got a note too. I mean, how... So it's a stove. And he makes them himself. And I'm going to assemble this sucker in a minute. I'm going to read a note here. I'll do it off camera and I'll come back. Alrighty. It's cool. It comes with a little pouch. A little wing nut for the, that holds it together. That's the top, this is the back, this is a windscreen, four sides, so front, this is the back, just going to line up the, line up the slots here. Alright, get the first time assembly. There we go. Oh, and I did it wrong, because uh this part here goes in at an angle, then you slide that. This is a step I forgot. Remember, this is the first time I'm setting it up. I mean, so as always, I don't, uh, I don't just practice stuff off camera.
big ash pan just sits on the bottom like that and then this uh, little piece here just rests on top which this thing is not not sliding together properly all right maybe I need a hard surface all right so she is all assembled uh, took me as soon as I put it on the table because the surface was harder than the mattress it just came right together very cool love it now this this part here is so you can put uh, things on top like canteen cup I guess you can't see so canteen cup fits on there nice and stable Butterfly handle canteen cup. No problem. How about a Stanley cook set? Yeah. No issues with the Stanley cook set. Frying pan. No issues. Goodwill pot. No issues. I think we're seeing a pattern here. Pretty much every Every cook set I've got will sit on here perfectly. A little uh, snow pea kettle. Couldn't ask for anything better. Of course, my dog bowl. No question. Sweet. Alrighty, so for those who are wondering, well, what's it weigh? Let's get the scale out. Uh, Two point. 2.2 pounds 12 ounces now this is the stove model there is a smaller version called the Nero or Nemo I'll have to check and then there's another there's another one called the runt so there's this one a smaller one and even a smaller one so all right gotta say initial impressions love it uh, a little tough putting it together first time, but you know it's because of the you know cameras on. I'm all thumbs, um, but you know it was right. I I literally just you watched me open it, so it's not like I was you know trying to fake it. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna run down the lows, and I'm gonna get a can of high temp barbecue paint, and I'm gonna be painting this before I take it out and do a burn in it. Because the, the fire I put in the stove will set the paint, you know, kind of season the paint a little bit. So I'm going to do a little sand on it and then paint it. But man, what a cool stove. Um, anyway, all uh, Fab Creations uh, YouTube page will be down in the description. I'm also going to put his email down there. I'm going to look for and find a video where he goes over all the stoves. He's got the runt. The Nero, the stove, and like Big Brother, and I'm gonna try to find that video and put it in the description as well, so you can just go and click it. Uh, just email them for pricing and which one you want. Uh, yeah, I think it's a total win. You're gonna see more videos with this for sure. I just gotta get it. I want to get it painted because the paint will protect the metal over time, so it won't get rusty and whatnot. So. Plus, I think it'd be a cool video and kind of a neat little project. Just get it all painted, looking good. I think black would really, it would look really cool if I painted it black. So, as always, uh, check the description below. I appreciate you watching. I thank you for watching. Uh, check out Fab Creations YouTube page, and I'll catch you in the next one.